Hello and welcome back to my kitchen. Today I'm going to be showing you a really classic Welsh recipe, lamb cowl, which is absolutely perfect for those colder evenings. So let's get started. So I've got a big cast iron pan here that I love to cook with. Any big saucepan will do. And I'm just going to turn this on now so we get some heat on it. And we want um, a medium to high heat. I'm going to add some rapeseed oil, which is my preference for cooking with. And let that heat up. And then I've pre-chopped all my vegetables. So I've sliced my onions, I've got cubes of sweet, I've got carrots, I've got celery and I've got parsnips in there. And what I try and do is get them to a similar sort of size so they're cooking at a similar uh, rate. But you don't need to be too fussy with it. Okay, so I'm just going to add these into my dish. I'm going to season it and a nice sprinkling of salt and we're looking to sort of soften all these vegetables we don't really want to colour them too much and the reason we cook our vegetables like this is to bring out the most flavour in our cowl which is basically the Welsh word for stew If you're not from Wales. So these are looking lovely now. They've started to soften up and you can see that they're a little bit looking they're looking a little bit more colourful. So I'm gonna take these off now, back into a bowl. Try and get them all off. I'm going to add a little bit more oil to my pan. I'm going to add in my lamb. Now I usually use a neck fillet, that's the best, but this is a cook from frozen diced lamb that we're going to be using today. We just want to brown this for a couple of minutes. Season it as well as we go along. A little bit of salt, plenty of black pepper. And by browning the meat like this, we're building up all that flavour again, all the caramelisation and the brown on the outside of the meat, giving us a delicious cowl. They're all looking nicely brown now, so I'm going to add in our vegetables, back in, give it another stir. And then I'm going to add in my beef stock. And you want to add in enough just to cover everything. Now add a stock pot in as well. Oh. I'm probably just going to top this up with a little bit more boiling water, um, just because we're going to be adding some more potatoes and leeks in a little bit, um, and this is only barely covering what we've got here. I'm going to leave this to simmer now for about 90 minutes, and it should be lovely and soft and bubbling away when we come back. This is looking lovely. So it's been about an hour and a half and we're just going to add in now all of our potatoes and the white part of our leeks. I've kept the green part of the leeks separate, they'll go in right at the end. I'm going to taste it now for seasoning as well. Mm. A little bit more black pepper. There we are, we'll uh, put this back on now and come back in half an hour. So the cow's looking lovely now. Uh, it's thickened up a little bit with the potatoes. So I've turned off the heat. I'm just going to add in the green tops of my leeks now. Just cook now in the residual heat of the cowl. And I'm going to add in um, some lovely fresh parsley. And I like to serve mine with a little bit of fresh parsley on top as well. Give it a bit of freshness. There we go. That's our cowl all made nice and easy. Well, thank you very much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video. I'd love to know if you give this lovely Welsh recipe a go, so leave me a comment down below. If you did enjoy the video, don't forget to hit that big thumbs up button. And if you want to see any more of my videos, just hit the subscribe button. And I will see you all next time. Bye!